Hello guys, in today's video, we're gonna check out the best FM antenna of this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I've tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability, and many more. To find out more information about these FM antenna, you can check out the description below. If you want to get a best quality FM antenna according to your needs, then watch the video till the end and then decide to buy. At the first position of our list, we have Menke FM Dipole Antenna. I first came to know the Menke FM Dipole Antenna almost 10 years ago, when I broke my first Stereo's original antenna. Checking with the manufacturer for a replacement, I was shocked at how much I would have to pay over 70 bucks. As a college student, that was too much for me at the time. So I decided to dig around see if I could get something cheaper out there without compromising the quality too much. A friend I was staying with recommended the Menke FM Dipole Antenna. I bought it for less than 10 bucks, so it was obviously a huge bargain. Plugging the antenna into my stereo, the sound quality was not in any way less in quality than the original antenna provided. It was as crisp and clean. I have to mention too that the setup was seamless, thanks to the fact that the unit fit perfectly on my stereo. I love the improvements on the antenna since 2010. Today, the antenna comes with both male and female adapters to pair with any stereo. The only issue I have noted is that the instructions are not very clear on how to work the cables and connectors. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Ankable Telescopic 75ohm Indoor FM Antenna. The Ankable Telescopic 75ohm Indoor FM Antenna offers some of the highest quality I have seen in a telescopic antenna. It is not only sturdy but also easy to use and effective at doing what it is created for. Pulling in the signal, a heavy-duty, high-quality brass copper material is what gives this unit its sturdiness. It is one of those aerials you can rely on to serve you for years without breaking as easily as I have seen some telescopic antennas do. The unit has 10 sections, with each measuring around 3 inches. So, you get more than 30 inches worth of height when you extend the unit fully. One thing I love a lot about this aerial is the reception. Installing this one on your stereo, you're assured of much less distortion, and even the capture of new channels. Ease of use is another area where the antenna wins over most other models on the market. Forget those units that come with cables that have to be handles and wired precisely to keep them out of the way. You also get a male F connector. That ensures you can use the antenna with virtually any stereo out there. The number 3 position is held by RTL SDR Blog V3 Dipole Antenna Kit. If high value is what you're looking for, you ought to think about the RTL SDR Blog V3 Dipole Antenna Kit. This kit presents you with a few items, including two differently sized telescopic antennas, a dipole base with an extension cable, a suction cup mount, and a flex tripod mount. With all this power, you can use the antenna for a wide range of different applications. You can use it with air traffic controls, trunk radios, weather satellites, public safety radios, and even with astronomical monitoring devices. If you want something that can tune down to 500, so when using Q-channel direct sampling, this device will do it. With it, you can seamlessly receive shortwave and AEM broadcast on the 25, 31, and 49 bands. Love listening to amateur radio at night. With the right ground plane, you can pull tons of signal thanks to the large whip antenna. If you are interested in trying out SDR, you definitely don't want to pass up on an antenna this cheap. The price is most certainly hard to beat. Next, at number 4, we have Turk Omnidirectional FM Antenna. Do you hate having to hang a 10-foot dipole antenna on the wall and hope it is in the correct direction? You're in luck because I found an antenna that is perfect for folks like you. The Turk Omnidirectional Indoor FM Antenna. As the name suggests, this is an omnidirectional antenna. It uses a 360-degree reception pattern that gives it the ability to pick up signals from all directions. This is the best antenna for FM radio with regard to the ease of installation and even movement. It is designed more like an electronic device than an antenna. So, you just place it, hook the cable to the radio, and start enjoying a clear signal right away. I love the design of its base. It allows the unit to stand freely and also fold flat when being mounted on a wall. I have heard many people complaining about the signal strength with this antenna. One thing I noted is that if you hook the antenna cable to your radio through a ballon, matching transformer, there'll be considerable loss of signal strength. 
I find it more appropriate to attach the antenna lead directly to the radio through an F connection. That way, you'll pick up even the weak college radios in your area. The best part? You get all this quality for just over 10 bucks. If you ask me, it's worth trying. The number 5 position is held by Turk Amplified and Slash FM Indoor Antenna. Here's yet another antenna that offers you a combination of great looks and better than average reception power. The Turk Amplified AM Slash FM Indoor Antenna is a tower antenna that looks like one of those elegant tower home theater speakers. Really cool! As a powered antenna, the unit ensures you get more signals than you're currently getting with the antenna that came with the stereo. It's a good option for both long and short range reception. I recommend you find the sweet spot and let the unit remain there without any movement. If the Turk Amplified AM Slash FM Indoor antenna has one thing going for it, it is the ease of setup. This is not one of those wire antennas that you have to struggle to set up. Moreover, the unit comes with an adapter that you can hook to a range of stereo receivers. Although the unit doesn't work miracles, and then you have to find the sweet spot, it is fantastic overall. You will get more FM stations and even a couple of stations. The antenna also clearly offers some amplification ability. The number 6 position is dominated by Ankable FM Antenna. Need a good antenna FM antenna under 10? Consider the Ankable FM Antenna. This is a Heap 75 ohm antenna for indoor use. One thing I do admire with it is the ease of use. The unit comes with an F-type connector, and all you got to do is push it in. It's a plug and play unit that you just plug into the back of your stereo and enjoy the functionality directly. Versatility is one of the joys of owning the antenna. You can use it with almost any brand of stereo out there, including Onkyo, Sony, Pioneer, Samsung, Yamaha, and more. I did not find the provided cable very long, but it's better than nothing for a product that costs so little. The provided length is 4.9 feet. There's one thing, though, that you need to understand. This antenna will not pick up the weak college radio signals in your area. What it does is offer a better reception for the stations that you've already been able to capture but with a weak signal. It strengthens the weak signal and lets you enjoy good audio clarity. When it comes to great value in an inexpensive antenna, almost nothing out there offers a better deal than the Ankable FM antenna. I recommend it for those who are on a tight budget. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Bingfu Magnetic Base FM Antenna. When I first saw the Bingfu Magnetic Base FM Antenna, I thought to myself, cool CB radio antenna. I thought the unit was meant only for vehicles, especially Jeeps. I couldn't even picture it as a unit anyone could use in their house. But that was until I saw a friend of mine using it in his home. I experienced the power of the unit for reception indoors. The radio which I previously knew to have lots of noise, most times I asked my friend to shut off the stereo whenever I was there. Now produced a crystal clear sound. Yeah, it looks like a Jeep antenna. But who cares? My friend exclaimed. And I agreed with him. What mattered was that the stereo no longer made annoying sounds when on FM. When it comes to the ease of setup and use, this is definitely a good unit. First off, it features a magnetic base. There's no worry about where to attach it, as long as you have a metallic surface where you can keep it. That being said, this feature won't be very helpful if you don't have a metallic platform to keep it. The unit comes with both male and female connectors to ensure compatibility with any stereo. There's even a connector adapter in the package. I found this antenna to work perfectly with Onkyo stereos. It also works well with other brands including Sherwood, Yamaha, and Pioneer. At just about 10 bucks, the antenna is definitely fairly priced. Check it out! The number 8 position is held by Ankable F-Type FM antenna for Bose Radio. Do you own a Bose Wave Radio? Are you looking for a way to boost its signal reception so as to be able to listen to radio more clearly? Try the Ankable F-Type FM antenna for Bose Radio. This is a specialty antenna built specifically for the Bose Radio. When it comes to a truly plug and play functionality, nothing works better for Bose Radio than this antenna. It comes with a quick connector that you just plug in and enjoy immediate signal improvement. You're provided with a free 5.9-foot coax cable. That is long enough to place the receiver high up on the wall to increase the chances of picking up signals. Yes, the unit is built specifically for the Bose radio. But that doesn't mean it can all work with other brands of stereo. You can actually use it with Yamaha, Onkyo, Sherwood, Panasonic, JVC, and more. And secondly, 
it ensures there is good signal reception. To tell you the truth, of the low-priced antenna units you can find, this is, without a doubt, one of the best indoor antenna for FM radio. It clears out the noise and picks up weak signals. Next, at number 9, we have Bose Wave FM antenna. Is your Bose radio giving you problems with signal reception? Having a hard time getting the stations? Or is it that there is too much static? You can solve all these issues with one little improvement, the Bose Wave FM antenna. Like the Bose antenna we talked about earlier, this is a specialty antenna meant for the Bose radio. Before we even talk more about the benefits that this unit offers, I want to clear up some issues. I notice that some people are complaining about the antenna's reception boosting capability. Well, at first, I experienced this same issue with the unit, but I noticed one trick. Don't let the connector go all the way in. It might work for you, or it might not. But, there's one thing you have to do. Position the antenna well. If you live in an area where the radio signal is poor, you might already know how important it is to have your antenna receiver up there. With the issue in mind, the seller provides you with a quite lengthy cable. The provided wire is 9 feet long. One thing you are going to love about this antenna is the ease of use. Forget the old-style screw design. This is a plug and play unit. You just hook the connector and start enjoying a better signal immediately. You might want to know about the price before even checking out this unit on Amazon. Well, to be honest, I find the price to be a bit of a rip-off. But go on and see it on Amazon. Check out the rest of the product's features and see if it's worth it. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Parts Express FM dipole antenna. Perhaps you don't want an amplified antenna that has to sit on a shelf. Maybe what you're looking for is a dipole antenna that you can tape up at the back, like behind a bookcase, where it's out of the view. In that case, I would encourage you to check out the Parts Express FM dipole antenna. One thing I have to make clear, though, is that this is not the right choice if what you're looking to do is pull in the weak signals coming from far away. As the unit features a simple design and happens to be unamplified, it cannot pull in the stations being relayed from very far away. It can only pull in the stations coming from your area. That is why I would recommend it for someone living in a metro area as opposed to the country. It works very well to capture the signals in your area and actually even removes the static, allowing you to listen to radio without noise. And again, for less than five, it performs excellently. If you are on a budget, this would be the perfect selection. That's all for today. We upload all types of TV and accessories review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for the coming video notification.